Hey YouTube, this is Dave, and today I'm going to show you how to install a MAME emulator right on your iOS device. Um, all you have to do is navigate to the App Store and search Gridly, G-R-I-D-L-E-E. -E. And uh, what this is is an emulator that you can install ROMs uh, onto your iOS device. You don't need to be jailbroken, or you could be jailbroken. And... Um, you can install these ROMs and play all these great games, uh, you know, from the yesteryear. Um, it's a wonderful, uh, wonderful little app, and uh, I would recommend you going quickly and getting it uh, before it's too late and Apple uh, removes it from the App Store. So after you get the app, um, you download it, and you'll have this icon on your desktop. And then the next step will be for you to download iExplorer. And this is a way to get into your uh, iOS device so that you can install the ROMs. Um, and then, of course, you have the website that you can go to and download ROMs. They're very small little files. And uh, I'll show you how to put them on your iOS device. So let's first download this uh, iExplorer and you can see that it will download here and then the next thing you want to do is you can go into and find one of your favorite games uh, let's look for I don't know Street Fighter I guess uh, that's one of the more popular ones uh, you can just search and see that they have hundreds and hundreds of games and uh, I don't know I'm just gonna pick one let's pick uh, Space Invaders that's fun and uh, your download link will appear after a couple of seconds or you have to watch a video or something like that but no problem just click download now and you'll see that it will download right here and uh, all you have to do is drag that in so now you have iExplorer so let's open that up and install it then you just have to drag the app right in and uh, let's drag that in and then we'll open it we'll go to iExplorer app and then we'll be able to see what it looks like so now you can buy now or you can uh, continue with the demo version and then if you just go into make sure your phone is connected to your connected to your computer so now that we're connected it will open up and then you just go to your iPhone and then you go to your apps and then you scroll down to the actual Gridly app okay so if you look here you'll see Gridly and you can expand that just go into documents and then you can just click on the ROMs folder and open that up so let's open up ROMs by double tapping it and then all you have to do basically is all you have to do is basically drag this right into the ROMs folder and then it will install right on your iOS device and that's it you're pretty much done and now all you have to do is then if you go into your Gridly app you will see let's move that over so now we can open up our Gridly app and you'll see that there are buttons and knobs that you can play and then if you just scroll down to our Space Invader game and I guess you hit the A button let's see maybe the B button or there we go and 
to return to the private. I don't know the controls, but I would think that you hit the start button, maybe. Or we have to throw some coins in there, maybe. And we can hit start. Let's try it. Like this. Ah, there we go. And it says usage. Just move the joystick to the left. And that's it. Let's see if this is the game. Let's hit start. Coin. Alright, to start, press one player. So I guess we'll just hit start. Ah, there we go. So now I'm moving along with my controls. And being that I am uh, airplay mirroring, uh, I get to use the controls on the device and actually have the game separate let's shoot the game up on the screen and the controls in my hand uh, so air that's pretty cool let's see if I if I disconnect from let's see if I disconnect from from being airplay mirroring if I'll get everything onto the screen. Yeah, I will. So let's do that, and we'll hit start. There we go. And now we have everything on our iOS device instead of using the iPhone as a controller and having it display up on our screen. So it's good to know that it does that. So if you're on the road, you could just play with it this way. It's been a long time since I played this game. And it's just bringing back so much memories. Now, there are hundreds and thousands of ROMs that you can download. And I think it's great. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. And I will see you on my next video. Thank you, and have a nice day.